Hey, this is Full Game Prometheus giving you another full game recap. Once again, going to be using Carolina Panthers on offense and on defense. Going to be trying to establish a more effective running game. And then I'm also going to be using the empty uh, gun bunch as one of my passing formations. So a uh, little bit switching it up. This going against the Cowboys, obviously using the Chicago Bears as my team. Uh, and I'm going to be playing around a little bit more with my offense and my defense. So uh, quickly out of the hole, he's showing me a nickel back. It looks like just a regular uh, nickel defense, so I use the off uh, uh, the power O. Missed my block right there. Should have cut it back on the inside, so I missed my run. Uh, but right here, just come out of the pistol formation and actually get a fairly good block and I'm able to go and pick up some pretty good yards. First and ten situation, doing the halfback weak off the left-hand side out of the pistol uh, formation able to cut it to the outside and pick up some fairly uh, easy yards on the ground so this gameplay you're going to be seeing me using a lot of running uh, against this opponent and I'm grind a ton of time off the clock with my opponent right here so uh, with uh, Cohen I'm able to go ahead and get down to a third and one situation and he's got basically about uh, seven guys in the box up uh, at the blockings there I find the hole I'm able to go and pick up a first down so two and a half of a quarter right now um, go back to the tri triple option and right here actually get a good seal block and Cohen's off to the races I'm able to go and pick up a good 20 yard gainer right there uh, on the ground so this guy's probably getting a little bit frustrated with this type of situation uh, go into the uh, play action comebacks uh, got uh, looking underneath and I actually Jump down to the underneath route a little bit quicker than I should have. I should have let that play develop. I had an opportunity to hit the tight end going across the middle. And right here, I'm in a pistol strong um, and uh, basically just hit the little hitch route because I think uh, his play already was showing me a lot of man blitzes. I think he was struggling against the run. He didn't really have any kind of defense for it. So wide nine defense right here out of the 43. I do like a nice little inside run. Uh, he gets a little block shot right here. Uh, and this is uh, out of the split black. Uh, this is the inverted veer. And I threw a bad pass right here. Um, I did not pay for it on that play, but there's um, another gameplay you'll be seeing where I actually do pay for it. On the block and release, I'm able to go and get a nice little completion, get it down to the eight yard line. So first and goal right here. And um, I don't know what I was thinking here. I just tried to do like a little inside run. And uh, he gets some block sheds and gets me into a second and goal situation. So I wasn't necessarily running any kind of an effective play. So I, I go ahead and hitch up the back rec receiver uh, with uh, Robinson and actually look for the little spot route. Uh, but his defender was playing right in the middle of the field and it, it didn't give me a good read. So right here, jump into the empty gun formation, motion my guy over. That's basically how I like to run these plays. I'm looking for the little hitch. The defenders float up, and I, I hit the little hitch route. And I get nice little animation, move, move forward, and actually go ahead and get it down to the two-yard line. But I'm going to settle for my three points. Look at all the time I, I took off the clock. Two minutes and 23 seconds left. I caught up a, a quarter and a half in the first series. Uh, so I'm feeling pretty confident. He's going to have to go and march the, 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 the field. Give me a sh uh, hurry up. Short, it should, d d That's it. I gave up a kickoff return. Completely mucked the clock, and he actually gets just a garbage touchdown against me. I know it's not garbage, and a kickoff returns, but... I felt like it was garbage right here. So he comes with a very aggressive man blitz. He gets two guys off the edge, and he's able to go in and get uh, me in a second and nine situation. So I come back and spot, streak up my uh, inside slot receiver, and just settle for the underneath. And right there, I'm able to go in and pick back uh, a good 12 yards of that play. Go back with Gabriel. Uh, he's a little slant route right here. Uh, with verticals. I actually threw right in front of his defender. I got I got away with a pass right there. And now I go into trail. He's sending a man blitz right here. Actually gets picked up. But he gets a, uh, some um, a block shot off the edge. And it, it was able to go ahead and sack me. Uh, or actually just uh, uh, hit my, my guy right there. So I go for the little spot right, right there. Miller actually makes a nice little comp uh, completion. Gets me a third and five, and I'll take the short yardage right here. Once again, showing up, uh, he's using a lot of man blitzes, so I actually hit that little slant underneath of the post. 
And right here, um, I go ahead and streak up my outside receiver Miller. I've got a corner out. I take Gabriel. I go ahead and block him. I'm going to go ahead and max protect to try to take away of any kind of reads. And he actually, he's manually blitzing. And, but the crossing route is wide open and able to go ahead and get out of bounds and pick up a first down. So 55 seconds left, feeling pretty good about myself. Go ahead and slide my guy over here in this empty set. And uh, really what I'm going to be looking is for the streak. And this little spot route gets actually really uh, glitchy animations. Uh, defenders don't play it correctly, and he always can get an easy completion. So no huddle. Hurry up uh, right here. Go back to the uh, trail route. I'm looking to the corner on the back end side. I'm going to go. I, I didn't actually motion the guy out. I don't know what I was thinking right there. And I actually had no reads uh, right there. I got lucky to get rid of the ball. So back to the spot rod again. Got the little whip on the back end side. Spot doesn't get picked up. And I actually waited a little bit longer. Should have got rid of that ball a little bit quicker and get the ball down, uh, down to the five yard line. So. Looking down in the red zone right here, try to hit the spot, and my def uh, my wide receiver does not come down with the ball. 18 seconds left. I decided to go ahead and YOLO, uh, YOLO just go for it. And um, I think I went ahead and put Burton on a, a block and release. I look for the little anger route that was actually taken away by the middle guy and actually hits me on the middle of the blitz. So come up short. I could have took three points. I chose not to. Um, and I decided to go for it. So first series here um, in the second half right now, he's up 7 to nothing. He's getting the ball back. I hit him with the 52 blitz. Uh, he basically did not block anybody right there. So I go ahead and hit him with cover 252 blitz again, and I'm going to go ahead and take away his tight end. His tight end's not um, an elite. He actually blocks everybody, and right here actually gets a make, he makes a good pass but does not come up the ball. It doesn't have the elite people right there. So I come with the man version of the blitz, and I actually get uh, just a little shed right there to go and get him and actually punts the ball back to me. So down three, uh, down uh, four points right here. I hit him with the, the, the draw play, which is the play action shot draw. Really weird animation. I don't know what was going on with Cone right there. He's like he, like he tripped on his shoelaces or something like that. Go back to the KC. Uh, Casey corner right here, and uh, the flat is wide. Actually, I go ahead and the crosser on the back inside. I'm able to go and pick up a first down. So just chipping away at this guy, uh, just suddenly for underneath, not stretching the ball at all. Right here, I actually get nice sealed blocking. Try to spin um, and spin right into one of his defenders, but that's all right. I uh, picked up nine yards on the ground. This is just a ground game that I'm actually attacking him with. And right here, go back to the play action comebacks and actually plays shallow. So I'm able to go to hit the crossing route with the tight end and get it down to the five yard or six yard line. So feeling good about myself right here. Go back uh, with, I think, uh, right here. I, I try to go ahead and do another, uh, just a, a play, something I don't necessarily run. Uh, that actually was not a good choice. Go back to uh, the underneath route, actually, and hit the guy on the back inside. So I could have went either high, low, but I'm able to go and get a touchdown right there. So uh, up 10 to 7, basically going into pretty much the third quarter. He actually runs the ball right up the middle. I come into it just to cover two look with, out of the 52. I've got basically yellow zones, a mid read right over the middle. Going to go ahead and take away his reads. I go ahead and send the dogs after him right here, and uh, he actually takes off this quarterback. I'm going to go ahead and stop him from getting to first down. Third and four situation. Go with the man version of uh, this uh, 52 blitz. Just try to try to give him a different look. And right here actually hits a deep in route. Perfect read. That's a perfect read, perfect down. And I think what I did right here is I actually did hard, no, I didn't do hard flats, but I actually had flats. He threw right into my coverage right there, and that is it. So uh, just because I was shredding this guy in offense, he didn't want to finish out. Once again, I'm a subscriber. Thanks for your support, guys. I really appreciate it. I'll be rolling out more gameplay with this Carolina playbook coming up soon.